Yep. Hey, man, say, man. Welcome back to another segment of Jays for Days, man. Look, I appreciate y'all for tapping in. I appreciate y'all for showing up and giving me them likes, man. I appreciate y'all. Um, without further ado, man, we're going to hop on off into this thing because I got two drops for y'all, man. Two pairs of heat. So, uh, yeah, man, we're going to get on off into this this first one, man. Uh, right here, we have the Bugs Bunny 8. Yes, sir. 8, man, it, it ain't too much I can say about this shoe, but it's a clean shoe, man. Uh, I think I got this shoe 2013 or 2014. I'm not too sure. I can't remember, man. But, yeah, man, look, I still got it. It's still here hanging on. You know, man, all I got to do is just do a little digging and I pop up on the shoe, man. That, you know what I'm saying? I did, I did. you know what I'm saying, wear a couple of times or a lot, you know. But, uh, yeah, man, like I said, it ain't too much I can say about this shoe, man. But the colorway on this shoe is A1. It's simple. Uh, it goes with a lot. That's why it's called the OG man. You can't you can't go wrong with with OG Jordans, bro. I mean, I like it. I ain't I ain't too big on all them colors and all that. I mean, if I do do a color, it's got to be one color with a little black in it. You know what I'm saying? Uh, a little white. But uh, yeah, man, that's this. I think this shoe came out after Space Jam. It had to. What am I talking about? 2000. Well, yeah, it had to for real because I think it's only been a handful of releases on these. You know how Jordan do. He do his years apart. But, uh, yeah, I got this from 2013, 2014. Uh, yeah. Came out after uh, Space Jam drop. Jordan had his Space Jam 11 zone in that movie. Uh, just get, Jordan gave y'all a... a Dope showcase of them shoes, man. And them shoes did numbers. Then when he wore them, yeah, when he wore them in Space Jam, he had the 45 on the back. And when they re-released, uh, got the 45 on the back. And that's another review for y'all right there. Space Jam 11. So, so y'all don't let me forget. Uh, yeah, man, that's that's all I can say about this shoe right here, man. Bugs Bunny, he did his thing in them. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. He'll still wear them. I actually got a Jordan shirt uh, with the Bordeaux Sevens that Jordan had on the Bugs Bunny had these on, man. So I think that's dope how Jordan uh, collabed with, you know what I'm saying, with the whole Looney Tune thing. So that was dope. But, uh, yeah, man, that's all I got for this shoe right here, man. It looked good going right back in the closet beside my, uh, my playoff eights. So, yeah, man, we going to hop on off into this next shoe. My... I call this a precious shoe right here, man. Cause like I said, 2013 was the year for all the all the drops, man. So this Jordan One right here. This is the OG. This is the one that Jordan wore when he first came into the league. And he also wore this shoe when he retired. Uh before he came back. So yeah, man. The 85 release of these right here, man. It didn't have nothing on the back when Jordan wore it. Uh, so, you know, all the new Jordans now, they don't have nothing on the back. But when these right here did drop uh, again when they came out later on in the year, it did have a, excuse me, it did have an X right there on the back. So I think that was dope. That was fire them to put that X on the back. Uh, but now all of the Jordans that's coming out don't have nothing back there. But I'm starting to get, you know what I'm saying? I like that. I'm starting to get that, you know what I'm saying? Get, get used to that no jump man back there. I think it's dope. You ain't got to be too extra. I mean, everybody know that you got a Jordan on, man. When they see this big uh, swoosh right here and they see that, they know what's going on. And then Juan's making a comeback too, man. When I first got this shoe, I paid 113 bucks for this shoe, man. I mean, the tax on these shoes was crazy. It had 110 on the tag. Well, actually, 99.99. So, yeah. That, that was crazy. And I got this shoe. That was crazy. And that was in 2012. But, uh, yeah, man, I, I say that to say this. It's a fire shoe, man. It's a dope shoe. 
you ain't gonna really find too many shoes like this. You know what I'm saying? That's still, you know what I'm saying, from 2012. I mean, if you do, man, y'all let me know. Y'all, y'all tag who got this shoe. Cause I wanna see what theirs look like. Because I will, when I got this shoe, I wore this shoe for maybe a whole year. From 2012 to 2013, I stopped wearing this shoe when I had my wreck. I don't know why. I guess because it's just been back in the closet. So it was like, all right. But when I did go do some digging, man. I was like, what? Here we go, man. Like, I thought these shoes would have been beat up, all that. But actually still good, man. And I want to let y'all in on something, too, man. Like, this right here, if y'all can see, it ain't nowhere near as white as this. It's kind of like brownish looking that's og right there i like that on this shoe um he did jordan did come out with some more shoes this is some jordan one sales i think it's black uh white with the red swoosh yeah yeah and it has that bottom on it like that like it's already been worn uh i don't think that was a good look for the for the newer shoe but I ain't the one that's making the shoe, man. I guess Jordan wanted to put that OG look on it. I mean, but the more I looked at the shoe, it was, it was cool. It ain't, it wasn't as yellow as mine. It was just kind of like, just off yellow. You know what I'm saying? Like from a distance, you weren't going to be able to tell. So, yeah, man. 1985, 2012, this shoe right here was the shoe to have, man, especially for me. Uh, I did mention this in one of my previous posts, reviews. Yeah, so I got it. I said I'm gonna show y'all what I got, man. This is Jays for days. I ain't gonna cap. Oh man, look, let me show y'all these tones too. Excuse me. This tone right here is totally different from the newer drops. This tone is a lot thinner. I mean, it has a lot of movement to it, a lot of play to it. You know what I'm saying? Like if you're wearing it, it's, it'll tend to do that. <clears throat> but this tone right here, this is the original tone that came on the ones. Uh, when they first came out with all of the all of the releases, man. So if I can have this tongue on this shoe, I'd be satisfied. But I'm still satisfied to have this shoe, man, because, you know, I don't see nobody wearing this one either. So, yeah, I mean, there, it might be some people out there, but I don't see them here. So, yeah, that's that's, a, that's another plus for me, man. But, uh, yeah, man, that's about it, man. We're going to wrap this up. Jays for days, man. Jays for days. We doing it, man. Look, y'all tap in. Y'all let me know what y'all want to see next, man. I'm, I'm, I'm looking at y'all comments, man. I mean, it's only the same people coming, but hey, man. Look, y'all the same people, so they comment. So, man, look, let me know what y'all want to see. I can make it happen, bro, bro. I'm gonna cut this short, man. Look, I gave y'all a little gist of the giveaway. Guys, go shop with Drip Talk Jewelry, man. Oh. Yeah, this is my yellow gold tennis necklace, man. He has bracelets like this. He has a uh, bracelet like this with without the stones in it, man. Uh, with the stones. Y'all give him a shout out. Man, look. If I influence y'all to shop with GLD as well. Uh, man, look. Y'all click that link. Y'all click the link down in the description, man. Look, I do got a code for y'all. To uh, use, man. If y'all if y'all decide that y'all want to shop with GLD, man, I will put that code there, man. So, yeah, man. Look, the holidays coming up, man. Ladies, get your man some. Fellas, get your lady something, man. And yeah, man, we gonna we spreading the love, man, all year. So, with that being said, man, Jays for days. Y'all stay safe out there, man. I'll be seeing y'all back with another review of some shoes that I got, man.